Mocha First Phase 2 is here with an insane price pool of more than 80,000 USD. You can win a Mocha NFT, Pixels Farmland, very rare Pixel Pets and more. It all takes place inside the Mochaverse Clubhouse. And if you have followed my first video, you can walk up to this room. In the top left, you can collect between 3 and 36 batteries every 24 hours. With those, you can walk to the claw machine on the right. Insert the batteries here and you have a chance of getting special items. You need those mocha items and together with common and rare resources from the Pixels game, you can make 5 different elements which represents the different mocha tribes. With those elements you can craft mocha stars. You can do this with the machine in the center of the room. Until January 12th, build as many mocha stars as you can to gain a higher rank. You can check the leaderboard right here in the lower left. If you want to know which prizes you can win at your rank, you can check the Mochaverse website. I will leave a link below. Now let's craft these elements. You can do this at the table in the middle. And remember, you need all five of them for one mocha star. For Angelite, you need an Angel Aura, which you can get at the claw machine, but you also need Sap and a blue potion. You can chop down trees to find Sap, but only when you are forestry level 5. And to make a blue small potion, just throw one of your cheapest items in these potion tables and let it cook for a few minutes. You can find these tables at land number 4081. To craft Bilda, you need clay from a mine, construction powder from a windmill, wax from a beehive and also a builder block from the claw machine. You can get clay when you are level 2 but you can only find it at a land farm. That is the one with green grass. Construction powder can be made with salt and bricks at a windmill. Collect salt from a mine on a waterland. That's the one with blue grass and you need to be level 5. The bricks can be made at a kiln. To create the cap neo element you need a Neo coin from the claw machine, explosive from a chicken coop and an iron bar. You need to be level 5 in the aviculture skill and you need ironite from the mines as an ingredient for iron bars so you can craft them at a kiln. The Conexa element needs a connector crystal from the claw machine, shrapnel from a windmill and also silk fiber from a silk hutch. You can make shrapnel when you are level 2 and you need the iron bars for that. Silk fiber is very easy to get. Just buy a silk slug and place it here on land 4081 and come back in an hour. The last element is Dreamix. You need Dreamer dust from the claw machine, silk slug spiders from a hutch and also flower. You already know the silk hutch and you can get the spiders here when you are level 5. You can make flower from the rainbow crops, plant them and go to a windmill to craft the flower. Now that you have all the 5 elements, you can craft your first mocha star. Keep on doing this to gain more points and a higher rank. And maybe you can win one of those NFTs that are worth more than 4000 US dollars. If you are overwhelmed by this, know that I tweeted most of this information a few weeks ago. So feel free to follow me on Twitter for more alpha information or subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you don't want to collect or craft these, or your level is not high enough, you can also buy the resources from the in-game market. But you need to be a Pixels landowner or have VIP to be able to do so. You cannot trade any of the mocha items with other players. Now there is one other mocha mission. You can choose one of the five tribes and the members of the winning tribe, that's the one with the most combined mocha stars, will get a ticket in the bonus reward pool. This means you have an extra chance of winning a rare Pixels pet or other Mochaverse items. And of course, you also get more realm points for Mochaverse. I have chosen the Neo Capitalists, so feel free to join and become the biggest tribe and maybe we can win those prizes. I wish you all good luck and if you made it till the end of this video, let me know which Mocha tribe you have chosen in the comments below. 
and I am really curious what you think of the intro of this video I've made on how to grow your grumpkins without them dying all the time.